I am Billy Green, Chief of the Fontana Police Department. The following community briefing will describe a significant incident which took place on Wednesday, November 27, 2019, shortly after 9 o'clock in the morning. The location of the call was in the area of Commerce Way and Santa Ana in the city of Fontana. This briefing will consist of the original 911 call and body-worn camera video footage recorded by the primary handling officer, Fontana Police Department Officer Josh McMillan. Fontana Police Officers Neil Bachman, Joseph Morales, and Steve Reed later arrived on scene and assisted in detaining the subject. Anytime a Fontana Police Officer uses force, all facts are reviewed and analyzed to determine if the use of force was objectively reasonable under the totality of the circumstances known to the officer at the time. The appropriateness of some uses of force are obvious, while others are complex and require detailed follow-up investigation. However, it is the expectation of the Fontana Police Department that officers practice a concerned response to all situations and intervene safely based on the information known at the time with adherence to applicable statutes and department policies. We honor our service to the community and respect the value of all human life. In this incident, the 911 call was routed to the Fontana Police Department Communications Center via transfer from the Ontario Police Department. The call was received into our center at 8.59, and a man with a gun call was dispatched via police radio to all units at 9.01. Officer McMillan arrived on scene at 9.04. Please be aware the following images and languages may be disturbing. Viewer discretion is strongly advised. 911. Hi, it's Ontario PD with a transfer. He's calling for Commerce Way in Slover, and he thinks a gentleman has a gun. Okay, thank you. Hello? Hello? Hi, why do you think this? I've uh, seen him pull it out once, and then I just kind of hid behind something so he didn't see me. Well, so what exactly happened? I was going into work, and I saw this man walking up and down the street, and he did. He looked. He looked disgruntled, very disgruntled. Okay. And when he saw the car, he he pulled the gun out, and so I just kind of drove into my workplace like a little faster than I normally would. Is he black, and white, I immediately Hispanic, called or you guys. Is he black, white, Hispanic, or Asian? He's black. What is he wearing? Yeah, he has dreads. Okay. And what is he wearing? Um, he's wearing a black sweatshirt. And, and some, some cargo pants. They're, they're, uh, they're brown. Brown cargo pants? Okay, where did he go? I'm looking at him right now. He's, he's still walking up and down the street. I don't think he sees me. Pacing this on, uh, he's pacing on Slover? Uh, he's on Commerce Way. Okay. And where is the gun? Where did he pull it out of? Uh, he pulled it out of his pocket. Okay. But I, I do I do need to go and twerk. Um, okay, what is your name? I, I feel a little bit safer inside there. What is your name? My name okay, and where do you work? At uh, HSN, the, uh, the warehouse. Okay, can they contact you if they need contact? W one more time. Can the officers contact you if they need contact? Yes, you can. You can call my number. Okay. And did he point it at you? He pointed it at the car, yes. Okay. And he, and then that's when I just drove. That's when I just drove a little bit faster. I, I didn't know what else to do. Okay. But I have to go into work. Can okay. I, All right. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Bye. -bye. Camera recording started. Tom eight M ninety seven. I'll be out with him. Just north of Santa Ana. Show me your hands. Show me your hands right now. Show me your hands. Do not pull anything out. Show me your hands. Show me your hands. Put them up in the air. Put them up in the air. Both of your hands. Put your left hand out. Pull your left hand out. Do not face away from me. Pull your left hand out. Pull your left hand out, right now. Do it, do it. Pull your hand out, do not pull a gun out. I'm telling you right now, I will shoot you. You understand me? Pull it out and put your hands up in the air. Listen to what I'm telling you. Pull your hand out. 
Pull your hand out right now. Pull your hand out. Dude, pull your hand out. I do not want to shoot you. Pull your hand out right now. Pull your hand out. Pull your left hand out, sir. Come on. I do not want to shoot you. Pull your hand out. Pull your hand out of your pocket, bro. Come on. Don't do this, man. Do not do this. Pull your hand out. Pull your hand out. I'm not going to. Pull your hand out. Pull your hand out, bro. Come on. Stop this. Don't fucking do this, man. Just pull your hand out. We'll get through whatever you're going through, man, but don't fucking do this. Let me see your left hand. Pull it out. Bro, pull it out. What is your name? What is your name? Talk to me. Hey, talk to me, bro. Come on. You're going through some shit. Let me help you. Let me help you. Pull your hand out. Bro, pull your hand out. What's your name? What's your name? Tell me your name. Tell me your name. It does matter, bro. Come on. Let me help you out. Let me help you out. Pull your left hand out so I can approach you safely. Pull it out. Come on, dude. Bro, pull your hand out. Pull your left hand out. Let me see it, man. Come on, pull it out. Pull your hand out, bro. Dude, pull it out. Let me see your left hand. I don't want to shoot you, but let me fucking help you. Come on. We don't want to do this, man. Bro, I'm telling you right now, pull your left hand out so I can see what you got in your pocket, bro. Dude, pull your left hand out. Pull your left hand out. I don't want to shoot you. Pull your left hand out. Come on, man. Pull your left hand out. Get your hand off of the gun, dude. I could see you're holding a gun. I could see the outline through your sweater. Pull your left hand out. Let go of the gun and pull your left hand out, dude. Pull your left hand out. Do not pull the gun out, bro. Just let go of it and pull it out. Thank you. Thank you. Just stay just like that, okay? Can you put your hands on your head for me? I got to place you in handcuffs. I'm going to fucking help you, bro, okay? I'm going to help you out. You may think I can't, but let me try. Just give me a chance. Okay? Put your hands on your head for me. Let me try. Put your hands on your head. Put your hands on your head for me. Tom, uh, he has his left hand on the gun. It's in his pocket. I can see it. He won't pull it out. I have him on his knees. Right hand is out. I have one at gunpoint. Seconds out, John. What's your name? Come on, dude. Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Look, my partners are coming right now. We're gonna put you in some handcuffs. Just stay just like that. Do not put your left hand back in your pocket or I will assume you're going for your weapon, okay? Just stay just like that. I don't wanna kill you, dude. Do not put your left hand back in that pocket. I'm telling you right now. Okay, stay right there. No, I don't wanna kill you. I don't wanna kill you. You're not dying today. Stay just like that. Guns in his front left pocket in his sweater. All right, come on. Walk out to your stomach. Walk out to your stomach. Lay, lay flat out on the ground. I don't want to kill you. I told you that. Lay straight on your stomach. Lay straight on your stomach. Put your hands out in front of you, man. Come on, dude. We don't want to hurt you. We want to help you. Want to help you. Well, let us try. Like I told you, let us try. Let's Neil, do you want to come in on his right hand? I'll come in on his left. Steve, you got cover. Stay just like that. 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 <laughs>
I told you we're not gonna kill you, dude. Going well, this way, it's gonna start up here in the front. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Where's the gun at, my man? You're the one that called on yourself? <laughs> Search his other side. He's claiming he called on himself. He doesn't have a gun, but we're still going to <laughs> sit you up. What's your name, man? <laughs> All right, let's get him. <laughs> Two, three. <laughs> <laughs> Let's sit down. We'll talk. Let's sit down and talk. Come on. Come on. Put your legs in. Come on. Sit all the way back. Sit all the way back. Slide back. Slide back. Come on, The person in this video was clearly experiencing a mental health crisis. Calls like this are becoming all too common, and our police officers are regularly thrust into volatile situations. The vast majority of calls for service nationwide are handled by caring and compassionate police officers and result in minimal uses of force. The unfortunate reality is this is not the narrative that is perpetuated by many in the media and anti-police activists. The man in crisis captured on video is the same person that had just called 911. He placed the call to facilitate our response in an attempt to commit suicide by cop. Had the man not responded to the tireless de-escalation tactics employed by Officer McMillan, the outcome could have been tragic for the individual in crisis and our officers. Despite my immense pride in the consistent, meritorious behavior of the men and women of the Fontana Police Department, I am aware the same great work is done by our police officers and deputies across the country every day. It is my hope that by watching this video for yourself, you will share in some of the pride that I have in our law enforcement officers. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video, and on behalf of the men and women of the Fontana Police Department, it is an honor to serve the community.